Hey guys, let's say that you created something incredible in After Effects. I'm talking about a composition that's packed with details, effects, and motion. But when it's time to preview your masterpiece, it's like stepping into a pitch black room with nothing but a flashlight. You can only see tiny pieces at a time, never the full picture. Now, if you've used After Effects, you know exactly what I mean. In order to play back and actually see what you're working on, you have to either lower the resolution, play back maybe just small chunks in the timeline, or maybe you've had to export your entire clip out of After Effects, again, just to see what you're working on. But that changes right now. Adobe just flipped the switch, the flashlight, gone. The room, lit up. This is one of the biggest workflow upgrades that we've seen in After Effects in a very long time. After Effects now uses RAM and disk caching together to keep your previews alive for longer. This means when you render something, it doesn't just disappear the moment you switch compositions or even close After Effects your preview stays cached so that you can jump back in without having to re-render everything from scratch. In order to experience this, just simply open up After Effects Beta. Disk caching is on by default, so you don't even have to do anything. I have here this crazy complex sequence. I render it all through and then check this out. I can close down After Effects and bam, when I bring After Effects back up, everything is still rendered. This has never been the case before. The green render bar represents where RAM is being used to render, and the blue render bar represents where disk caching is being used to render. And that's it.